News 8 bringing you a new regular series, Generation Rock, all about highlighting amazing young people in our region and the great things that they do. I had the great privilege of sitting down with our very first feature, a local teen who not only embraces herself, overcoming her disability every day, but also she chooses kindness by sharing her gift with others. They say artists put a piece of themselves in every work, getting as close as they can to their craft. East Ridge High senior Maddie Underhill gets right up close to her art, both for the pleasure but also to combat a disability. I'm able to stay connected to the world around me, but it is limited, and I would much rather have limited than none at all. Maddie was born with foveal hypoplasia, basically a dip we all have in our eyes never fully developed for Maddie, meaning she's legally blind, unable to perceive most things at a distance. However, when growing up and developing her passions, as all young kids do, she quickly found something she loved and could do well when she first picked up pens and paper. I would touch it, feel it, twist it and turn it, figure out how it works really early on, and then realizing paper doesn't move. Paper isn't far away. It's not an item that is dangerous and you can't get too close to it. Maddie spent years studying things she wants to draw, like cars and animals, learning to judge distances through reference photos and creating her own spin on the world she could see. Art is never going to be perfect. It's, it's kind of the beauty of art. It's not meant to be perfect. It's meant to be its own thing. In fact, you can find pieces of Maddie all over Eastridge High, since she says she likes sharing her art with others. So this is a picture that Maddie made me a few months back. And it's beautiful. It looks like my old dog. <laughs> this school has given me the education that I've that I'm really grateful to have. It's given me plenty of opportunities to do art. Her latest installation parked squarely in the high school's front lot. Every senior gets their own parking spot, painting them with a design each their own. But Maddie donated hers to her principal, David Dunn, who's a massive Buffalo Bills fan. Just her gesture to want to do that was one thing. But then to actually have her spend weeks out there and, and do it. Uh, it's just, it's, it's just huge. It's just huge, and it's something that I'll never forget. Principal Dunn says in 27 years of teaching, he's never had his own parking spot. But this one means so much more with Maddie's sweet appreciation behind it. And I'll be honest, I had tears. It's all about making connections and relationships with kids. Here's a student that made a connection with me. She's a special kind of person that devote their life and their time to wanting to better the next generation of this world. Such an amazing story. In fact, if you know an outstanding young person in your life making a difference in our region, reach out to us and tell us all about the great things they're doing. Email us at news8sunrise at wrctv.com. We have that email for you up on the screen now, and we want to share their story right here on News 8.